A warning from Fredericton police tonight about a dangerous drug linked to recent fatal overdose. And the warning is being heeded by frontline services right across the province. As CTV's Nick Moore tells us now, what makes this drug a particular concern is that it does not respond to common overdose interventions. The drug is called bromazolam. It was developed in the 1970s but never approved for human consumption. So not many people knew about it until a few years ago when it began appearing mixed with street drugs including meth and fentanyl. You can't see it, smell it, or taste it. Fredericton police say bromazolam is linked to a recent fatal overdose. Be aware that that drug is now out there and it is deadly. Narcan does not reverse the effects of that drug. While it does reverse the effects of opioids, uh, it is not effective uh, in this, with this drug. If it's in Fredericton, people throughout the province are using it. I mean, that's just a given. Julie Dingwell of Avenue B Harm Reduction in St. John says the Fredericton police warning is helpful in getting word out about the dangers of a drug many may not know about. It alerts us too. And it, it just, uh, even if we know that it's already going on, it, it's an, another opportunity to talk with people. Like, you know, all, all of our staff today will be talking to people more about these benzos and about how to take better care of themselves, how to test their drug, you know, doing just a little at a time. And by not using alone, where they're most in danger of dying if they use alone. Fredericton police also urging people not to use drugs alone and to call 911 immediately if they believe an overdose is happening. The Good Samaritan Overdose Act does apply, so anyone experiencing an overdose or anyone uh, assisting someone who is uh, experiencing an overdose, uh, they're not subject to any legal or criminal uh, charges after that, after the fact. Earlier this month, Fredericton police made note of 64 overdose calls so far in 2024, already passing the total number of overdose calls in Fredericton last year. Nick Moore, CTV News, St. John.